Uh, I checked there. I can't remember her name. Uh, it's a person that loves uh, second life and such kind of things. I think this could be interesting for her, but I can't remember her name now. Too bad because I would like to post this to, to her. Uh, but okay. The new Chrome is here. Now it supports 3D graphics directly. Directly. In the web browser, it now has GPU acceleration. I will do one, one more test here. I know she starts with an S. Oh, I can't remember. Yes, there. Summer Seal. Something for you, maybe? So, as you can see, her name was added down here. Uh, and I have a public post. So everyone can see this post, but Summer Seal will be um, mentioned and have a notification of this post. So every person you add in a post or in a comment will be notified by the post. That's how Google Plus works. Very cool. So you can add uh, people you want to read what you post. Uh, it's like on Twitter you can uh, at mention a, a person at, and the person gets that as a mention in, in uh, the interaction uh, tab. So it works like that on Google Plus 2. You type a plus and the name afterwards. And now I hit share. So once again, uh, to have you understand what I just did, you can, when you post something on Google+, Plus, you can mention someone by doing a plus and then start typing the name. Christopher Rizzo, for example. As you can see, I only type C and H. And his name is at the top, and I can just hit return, and his name will be typed and added to the list of people to post to. So you can do that with anyone, Rob Google, for example. It's a nice, nice feature to add people. Uh, so they get a notification of the post you are doing. So you can do this in a comment too, so you don't have to uh, you do that in the post itself. You can do it in a comment after the post has been posted, of course. But uh, I think it works great.